Jesse James Decker slams awful body shaming comments. After reading damaging comments about herself online, Jesse James Decker took to Instagram with a tearful unfiltered message about how the criticism affects her. Read her moving message below. There's an ugly side to the internet, and Jesse James Decker is calling it out. On Tuesday, July 13, the mom of three took to her Instagram story and explained to fans that she recently learned about a Reddit page that as she described, rips me apart on a daily basis. They're talking about how apparently fat I've gotten and how boxy and how terrible my body looks, the 33-year-old said. And they're accusing me of editing my body and all these things. It's pretty awful and I just cannot believe this is still happening in the world, that people are doing this. Decker, who was shocked and in disbelief over the comments. Shared that she previously obsessed over her weight, but has since decided to just let myself live. I work out and I eat what I want and I 100% am 10 pounds heavier than I used to be, she admitted. I used to weigh, like, 115 and I am not anymore. I eat what I want and I am happy with that. But when you are writing blogs and stories and bullying me about how much weight I've gained and how fat my thighs are. I do take that offensively because what is the messaging that you are sharing? As she asked online critics, how can you wake up and live with yourself? While she took a strong stand against the behavior, Decker was visibly hurt by the situation as she began to tear up. It does make you stop and you look in the mirror and you go, oh my god, is there something wrong with me? She said as her eyes welled up. I am such a strong, confident person and I always have been, but it does hurt my heart a little that people are ripping every little thing about me apart. Decker, who is currently vacationing with her seven-year-old daughter Viviane, noted that she went into the bathroom so that her child wouldn't see her upset. It's mean and it's bullying, she said. And it's not okay and I hope my daughter doesn't grow up in a world where people do this to her because it's wrong and I think we all need to do better. As she concluded her message, the former E! star had some reminders for those ripping her apart. I just want you to keep in mind that I am a person. I am a human being and your words hurt me, she said.
I know that I am not perfect, but you pointing out my flaws, the things that I am already insecure about, it already hurts me. And it doesn't feel good to be picked on or bullied or ripped apart. I've dealt with it my whole life and I thought it would be over once I became an adult and it's not, but just know you're not alone. She told viewers she was going to wipe her tears, pull it together and make sure her daughter enjoys the trip. But first, one last piece of advice for the critics, if you don't like me, then leave me alone. If you don't like what I have to say, if you don't like what I do, if you don't like anything about me, then stop paying attention to me. Just leave me alone. Don't obsess over what I do. Don't look at my pictures. Don't look at my videos. Don't look at my posts. If you don't like me, leave me alone.